fishing has long been a sport of the Midwest, but did you know here in Utah we have a silver medalist in the sport? In this Eye on Utah, Kristen Kenny catches a glimpse into the world of ice fishing with a local pro. I like to get away from the crowd. This is a typical day for Joe Martinez. Sun up, sun down fishing. But he's not your typical angler. This Utah is a member of the U.S. ice fishing team who just won silver at the World Championships in Mongolia. A lot of people in the U.S. don't know and don't realize how big of a deal it was. A big deal because it was the first time that the USA reeled in a medal overseas. It's taken a lot of years. It's a different type of fishing. It's a lot, yeah, a lot more than sitting on a bucket and fishing and drinking beer. It's nonstop action. It's a good one, too. With the winner catching the most weight in fish over a three-hour period. Bringing a fish up and bait back down to the bottom in 40 seconds. With a different type of equipment. It's a little rod. I didn't realize it would be... Wait till you little. see the ones we actually fish with. Like this one, called a palm rod, that allows them to fish much faster. When you catch, you bring it in with your fingertips, and then you throw it so it keeps your line straight. So you take the fish off, and then you're ready to go back down. Do you wear gloves doing that or no, no? it's pretty hard to do with gloves on, so you just deal with the cold. It's about braving the elements. You really test yourself. And it requires a lot of recon. Seven days of pre-fishing just to figure out what baits, what hooks, what lines. So what got this Utah hooked to the sport? The conditions are hard, but when you get out here, it's beautiful. I'm obsessed with it. So obsessed that when he saw a link to the World Ice Fishing Championships online, he quickly jumped on it. There's a world championships, and I was hooked. <laughs> and they lured him in. They offered me to come as a spotter. A spotter is like the team's eyes on the ice. See what's going on, see where people are catching fish, keep an eye on how fast he's catching fish compared to the other anglers. Today, he's my spotter, showing me the ropes, or shall I say, lines. <laughs> Moving around the ice to find the perfect spot. And when you get a bite, <laughs> there's nothing like it. And on that note, <laughs> oh, buddy, did I hurt him? Did I hurt him? Nope, you're fine. Take it and just put his head in the water. Catch you next time. Kristen Kenny, KUTV 2 News. I, I, oh think my Kristen, gosh. I think Kristen scared the fish when she screamed. <laughs> yeah, I think Jumped so. right out of her hands. <laughs> <laughs> well, he did tell us the World Championships will be in the USA next oh. year, and he hopes to reel in another medal. Wow. Pretty cool. Good luck to that him. Was very interesting.